humans have always been fascinated with mythical creatures and fictional beings, and one of the most popular among these characters are dragons. Furry or scaly, playful or deadly, these mystical and majestic creatures add suspense, drama and occasionally humour to our favourite fantasy movies and series. Today, dragons appear in a wide variety of movies, television series, video games and more. But before modernisation, these majestic beings appeared mostly in legends, lore books, short stories and beyond. Dragons are certainly the greatest and most famous of mythical creatures that inhabit our dreams, haunt our nightmares and have left a permanent mark on the cultures of mankind. Welcome to Factolic. Today, we will be counting down our picks for the top 10 fictional dragons in film and TV. So, without further ado, let's start with the list. Number 10. Draco. Dragonheart, 1996. Draco was the first dragon to appear in the film series and was also one of the main protagonists of Dragonheart. It was one of the first films to feature a digitally created character that could speak and star alongside real actors, and its impressive computer animated effects earned the film an Oscar nomination for visual effects. Draco was a wisecracker with a sense of humour, but nonetheless a very noble dragon. He was also selfless, giving up his life and the existence of his species to kill Ainon and save the kingdom. His powers and abilities include camouflage, fire breath, aquatic affinity, heart sharing, dragon strength, dragon durability, dragon endurance, speed, agility, and the list goes on and on. Number 9. Falcor the Luck Dragon from the movie The Never Ending Story, 1984. At number 9, we have one of the most unique dragons to have graced the silver screen, Falcor. Falcor is a wingless creature from Fantasia with a dog-like face, soft and white fur, and a pearly pink scaly back. He is a friendly and dignified dragon, helping Bastion to remember the values of perseverance. His appearance is both draconic and dog-like, with a long body, large paws, and white fur. Apart from the ability to breathe fire and their incredible luck in everything they do, luck dragons like Falcor do not possess immense physical strength or magic abilities. Still, Falcor's loyalty, affection and memorable appearance all make him worthy of a spot on this list. How lucky! Number 8. Dragon. Shrek. 2001. Dragon is Donkey's love interest and eventual wife from the Shrek franchise. Dragon is a giant magenta red female dragon who is 100 feet long or 30 meters from snout to leg. She sports a pink belly, maroon spines, white spikes on her cheeks, webbed ears, bat-like wings, razor sharp claws and a long spade tipped prehensile tail. Despite her love for Donkey, Dragon is still a dangerous and destructive carnivore who has eaten many knights and Lord Farquaad, although the latter act was to protect Shrek and Fiona. 7. Hungarian Horntail, Harry Potter series. The most dangerous of all dragon types in the Harry Potter series, the Hungarian Horntail has the longest fire-breathing range of all dragons. Horntails are also known for being one of the most vicious and aggressive breeds of dragon, and that is saying something, since all dragons are known to be ferocious. Even Rubius Hagrid commented on their ferocity, saying that the Horntail was a right nasty piece of work. Horntails are also able to keep up with Harry Potter's flying skills, a very impressive feat considering Harry's talent as a seeker. Number 6. Elliot, Pete's Dragon, 1977 and 2016. Elliot is the titular dragon of Disney's Pete's Dragon, both the 1977 film and the 2016 remake. He is a large green dragon with purple hair and spines who befriends Pete, the young orphan of the story. Elliot also has the ability to become invisible and is fairly clumsy but good-natured. Elliot serves as a guardian dragon to children in need and is fiercely protective. In the remake version, Elliot is said to be a fierce dragon known as the Millhaven dragon who lives in the forests of the Pacific Northwest, Millhaven. 
we have Elliot above relatively more powerful dragons on the list because of it being a more central character and based on its popularity. Number 5. Shenron Shenlong Dragonball Series most of us must already know about Shenron, given the immense popularity of the Dragon Ball Z anime series, which is still going on strong ever since its inception in the late 80s. Shenron, also called Shenlong, is the divine dragon god of the Dragon Ball series. He is a massive, green-lunged dragon with antlers and glowing red eyes, and he alternates between being aggressive and impatient, and considerate and understanding, assisting the Dragon Ball holder of how best to make their wish. For as powerful as he is, Shenron is fearful of Beerus, the god of destruction. And of course, as the series evolves, so does Shenron. Dragon Ball Super introduced Super Shenron, and Dragon Ball GT introduced Ultimate Shenron. Number 4. King Ghidorah At number 4, we have our very own King Ghidorah. The golden three-headed dragon Ghidorah is one of the most beloved and feared kaiju of Toho's monster movies, inspired by the legends of Yamato no Orochi, the eight-headed dragon. Its origin often changes, but one thing is the same across every appearance. Ghidorah is the arch-nemesis of Godzilla. In some films, the three-headed dragon is an alien planet killer, while in other versions, it is a genetically engineered creature from the future, or even an ancient guardian beast of Japan. King Ghidorah frequently ranks high on fictional monster lists for its impressive presence and sheer power. Number 3. Drogon, Viserion and Rhaegal, Game of Thrones Named for various important figures in Daenerys' life, Drogon, Viserion and Rhaegal are the prominent dragon figures featured in the Game of Thrones television series, along with George R. R. Martin's A Song of Ice and Fire series. Drogon, Daenerys' own mount, was named for Karl Drogo and is the largest, most aggressive of the three dragons. Rhaegal was named for her brother, Rhaegar, and has no rider but obeys his mother's commands. Finally, Viserion was named for Viserys, and his fate led him to his demise by the Night King, who later revived the dragon as one of the undead. Number 2. Toothless – How to Train Your Dragon while Toothless also starred in the How to Train Your Dragon book series, the world fell in love with this deadly but adorable dragon in the DreamWorks How to Train Your Dragon film trilogy. Upgraded from a common green garden dragon to a sleek and mysterious Night Fury, Toothless is described as the last of his kind. With jet black scales and massive wings, he is a natural predator in the world where dragons and vikings collide. But he's just so cute! Inspired by a number of animals, not just lizard-like ones, Toothless reminds many fans of their beloved pets. And his evolution throughout the trilogy, growing up alongside Hiccup, the son of the Viking leader, is amazing. Number 1. Smaug, the Hobbit At number 1, we have Smaug, the legendary literary dragon from J.R.R. Tolkien's 1937 novel, The Hobbit. Described in text as the greatest of the dragons of his day and a most specially greedy, strong and wicked worm, Smaug is a powerful and fearsome foe. He is most known for invading the dwarf kingdom of Erebor, where he guarded a vast mountain of treasure. Smaug earns the title of most frightening dragon on this list. If you ever hear the words, I am fire, I am death, you should probably start running. That was all for this list. Hope that you all enjoyed the video. Do you agree with our list? Which fictional dragons are in your top 10? Do like, share and leave your comments down below. For more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to our channel and hit that bell icon to get notified for any new content we upload.